On Friday, Canada will temporarily ban the import of restricted handguns in, in a measure designed to try and prevent gun violence on our streets. Originally, the federal government wanted to ban look-alike toy guns. Now there are some products being sold that look like handguns. Pat Foran has our story on Consumer Alert. Pat. Nathan and Michelle, a concerned viewer sent us photos of a screwdriver for sale that looks exactly like a handgun. It's being called a novelty item, but we asked the public and the police if they have any concerns about this type of product being sold. It's a 3.6 volt cordless screwdriver gun that sells for less than $20. Even though it's blue in color, it looks like a replica handgun. A concerned viewer who received this flyer contacted CTV News saying they felt the product should be removed from store shelves. We decided to ask people what they think of selling a screwdriver that is shaped like a handgun. I don't know what they were thinking when they designed this. I think there'd be too many people who would try to use it as a gun. I don't think this is something that we should bring into the market. Why would you make a screwdriver to look like a handgun? It's not safe. For me, having a product that looks like a gun but isn't, if I saw someone holding this, I'd probably freak out. The product is being sold through Princess Auto Stores. We've asked officials at Princess Auto if they've had any complaints about selling this product and if they have any concerns selling a screwdriver that looks like a handgun. In a statement to CTV News, a spokesperson for Princess Auto said, Our cordless screwdriver gun is considered a novelty item. It has been modified from black to blue to make it even less realistic. The sticker on the front indicates the product is a screwdriver. The screwdriver gun is for sale at a time when importing handguns will be banned August 19th, and legislation has been considered to ban look-alike toy guns. A spokesperson for Toronto Police said, We would not recommend purchasing an item that could be mistaken for a gun. This could potentially result in a dangerous situation for both officers and the person using the item. Princess Auto did say customers can return or replace any item they're unhappy with. And while a product that looks like a gun or toy guns may not seem like a big deal, police say they pose a challenge. In a fast-moving situation, fake guns need to be treated like real ones, which could lead to tragic circumstances. On your side, I'm Pat Foran.